Hello, the following presentation is for the new Idle Indexer custom task and was developed by Smart Team LLC. This custom task is going to enable Liquid Office workflow to index content into the Ito Autonomy Idle search engine. In this demo, we have two tasks. The first task is a form task used to collect the data, and the second task is the new Idle Indexer custom task. So you can see our workflow here and we have our e-form and as soon as the form is submitted it's going to go to the idle indexer if we go to the idle indexer properties tab you can see that the configuration is very simple you will specify the HTTP information on where your idle server is located and you can specify some parameters below you can select the parameters you want to use for the for indexing from the drop down list So if we go look at the eForm, we can see what data we're going to be collecting for this demo. We're going to be collecting the reference, the date, title, the database name you want to index the content into, duplicate option, and content. So let's go ahead and start the demo. And first, I want to show you that there is nothing currently in the idle server. So I'll run the command and it shows nothing in the document store. Also, if we take a look at the Smart Team alert inside the portal in a box, which is available free from Smart Team, and you can request this at smartteamllc.com. And if we bring up this, you can see that it's currently searching for documents and there's nothing out there, so you can see that it says no hitch yet when we'll continue to scan the indices. So I'll go ahead and go to the Liquid Office web desktop and open the idle indexer process. And as you can see, the form has been pre-filled with some data. For this demo, we are going to be using a news article regarding the partnership between Smart Team and the City of Boston. So, this is the document that will be indexed. And I'll just go ahead and select the date and specify a title. And select the duplicate option. As none and submit the form. And the form was submitted at 1116. So if we go to our management console and we refresh, we can see that the process and we can see the origination date was 1116. If we go in here, we can see that both tasks have been completed. So let's go back to the idle server and verify the content. I'll run this command again and you can see now that document information is showing up. And we'll go back to our portal in a box and you can see that the document has shown up. So that's it for the demo. Um, if you have any questions or inquiries, please visit us at smartteamllc.com. Thank you.